It is cold outside, my God. Whew. Super excited for today. Uh, we're doing something new. Finally got a new shop. We are in beautiful snowy Oslo. Today's the day I've been waiting for for about three months now when I signed a lease for a new shop. And today, right now, we're picking up the keys for the new shop. Super excited. Let's do this. This is it. Whew. My new shop. I'm very excited for this. As you can probably tell. Just got here. It's actually nice and warm in here. Got one thing in here so far. Table saw and a little sander thingy. Uh, the other guys are on their way right now. I'm gonna be renting this space with another two people, Simon and Lucien. I'm very excited to use this space for all sorts of cool stuff in the future. I'm gonna be focusing all my time on building out this space uh, so that I can be making better content for you guys. And hopefully you want to come along with me on that journey, both as we set up the shop and as we continue to make better and better stuff that you guys, I hope, will like. All right, I'm gonna start moving into my stuff now. All right, a little update. It's still snowing. Right now we're on our way to get some materials to build walls and to build a kitchen. And in terms of weather, it's still pretty much the same. Now it's maybe even a little bit worse. Look at that. So on this side, Simon and Lucien are going to be having their workshop. And on the other side of the wall, that's going to be my space, which is going to be where I'm going to be focusing on making videos for you guys. So this is about where the wall is going to be. And then also, we're going to pick up some materials today to build the kitchen right over there. So this is where we're going to build the kitchen. Um, these are the windows that you saw us community use as our service entrance yesterday. And the plan here is that we're going to build a plateau that is going to be about half a meter high so we can store sheets of wood underneath. And then on top of that, we're going to build a kitchen. And then the idea is to build a little glass box around it so that when we sit inside the kitchen, we don't need to worry about the dust that's going to be produced from uh, all the machines around here. So the plan for today is that we're going to go pick up all the stuff from our previous workshop and then move it all in here so we have all our tools, all the materials, all the things we need right here. Then we're going to do the same store as yesterday and pick up some more uh, plywood insulation and things like that. We're still not that firm on how the kitchen's gonna look, but we'll figure out that as we go. And uh, hopefully you guys wanna come along for a ride. All right, I'm gonna go pick up Simon now. Oh yeah, and sorry about the terrible acoustics and the not super nice lights in here. We're gonna take care of that eventually.
So we're just loading in in the stuff for the car now. So far we've got the plaster boards, almost all my materials and almost all my tools. And this is the car so far. <laughs> my God. So this is gonna be trip one. And then the next trip, we're gonna get the stuff from the boys and the tools from the boys as well. Oh yeah, and we bought a bunch of rock wool that's gonna go on top as well. Now it's full. Man, we really picked the best day for moving. I just love moving in snowstorms. So it's pretty late now. As, as you can see, it's still snowing like crazy. Simon is very happy. <laughs> uh, we decided to go and get a kitchen. That's a kitchen right there. Doesn't look like much, but it's fully functional. What do we get? A fridge? Oven, stove, dishwasher, we're super happy. All right. Man, that was a long day. My shoes are soaked, I'm super tired. But I'm also really happy. We got a lot done today. We moved almost all of my stuff, all of the wood that I had over there. And I didn't even remember that I had this much stuff, but apparently I did. We still have a kitchen in the car. It's amazing what you can get for free if you're just willing to disassemble it and carry it down four flights of stairs. But that's hopefully gonna be great for the kitchen that we're gonna build over in the corner there. So tomorrow, all that's left is the kitchen that's now in the car. We need to move that into the space. And then there's also all the things from the other two guys that we're gonna be moving tomorrow. So a similar amount of tools and a similar amount of wood. And then coming next week, on Monday, we're gonna start building. And I'm really looking forward to that. I think that's it, see you tomorrow. <sighs> I think that was the least organized way of putting any of that stuff in the shelf. But at least it's out of the way now. What do you guys say of a little tour of all the stuff that we moved in here so far? Uh-huh. Wall of tools that you just saw me move. Toolboxes. I have a video of this. More random tools. Table saw. Little sanding thingy. Rock wall. Drywall. Windows for the kitchen. Managed to break one already. A ton of two by fours. Big delivery from Ikea. Fridge. Half a dust extractor. The other half. Saw. Parts of a kitchen. Small little dishwasher, hot water heater, little compressor, Lucien's project, materials, a lamp, an oven. Okay, I think we'll wrap it up for this episode right now. I uh, hope you enjoyed that little tour of all the stuff that we moved in here so far. Finally, now we're at a point where we have enough materials to start construction. 
First thing we're gonna start on already tomorrow is that wall. We're also gonna start thinking about the kitchen. If you like this video and wanna see more like that, please consider subscribing, please consider giving it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching, see you guys in the next one. Um, I just picked up a door. It doesn't, I mean, it fits. It fits in the car. It's just not super comfortable to drive. But it's a door. <laughs>